Hi, my name is Jillian Kay. I'm an artist from the St. Louis area, and I wanted to show you how I did my WandaVision envelope art for Write On 2021. So I'm starting with just a loose sketch here in pencil. I have a reference photo uh, that I'm referring to over and over again as I put in those uh, important lines to work off of for any illustration. This is the part of the process I spend the most time on because if I don't get the structure right, I, it's not gonna be able to be fixed once I put ink on it, like I'm doing now. So I'm using a Sakura of America Pigma brush pen, going over all my line work. I really like these pens for illustration, for lettering, uh, but definitely, definitely for illustration. I go through these pretty quickly, uh, and I almost always use them. Like when I do Inktober, um, I'm using Pigma brush pens probably 100% of the time. So going over my pencil work here, not adding too much detail because I know I'm gonna go in uh, after I put in my grayscale stuff, I'm gonna go back in with that same pen and add more detail. So these here are Sakura of America Moonlight Jelly Rolls, the gray series that they came out with not too long ago, maybe one or two years ago. They're a great set of pens. Um, especially for WandaVision. I just thought, how perfect are these pens to do uh, illustration of WandaVision from either the 1950s or the 1960s? And I chose the 50s because she's just, she's cute as a button in either era, but I liked this one just a teensy bit more. So I'm going in, I'm adding value, adding shadows. Um, I'm taking my Pigma brush pen again and going in and adding more line work, doing cross hatching, and then adding an outline. I do that for a lot of my illustrations. Uh, and then I'm gonna add her recipe cards flying all about. But most importantly, you have to add a stamp and an address because I'm going to be sending this envelope in the mail to Katie. And thank you to Katie for allowing me to use her address and name on this envelope. So I'm using my Pigma brush pen to do lettering too. Um, I'm gonna go in and add some like 1950s Sputnik-y type de decorations here around her name. Um, fill in the recipe cards a little bit. And then I thought I'd add a pop of color here to uh, represent the hex. So finding my brightest red, filling that in as best I can. And then I'm gonna add my information here just in case it needs to get returned to me. So that is my WandaVision envelope. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to put them in the comments.